two, one, go. Now the semi-final match pits the number three alliance against the number seven alliance. Three versus seven. Thomas period. Coming to a close with each alliance able to score. Referees will climb into the field now to take a quick look around. Count up the sacks that are located there to try to determine which of these two alliances, if any, has an advantage. Advantage over the Blue Alliance. Blue Alliance having scored some bonus sacks. And now, folks, we begin the driver control period. It begins in three, two, one, go. And we're underway. A perfect opportunity to tell you who we have on our field. For the Red Alliance. That'll be Alliance number seven, 8227 Bravo. That's the team from Alfi, China. Their alliance partner is T Vex. They're 90 and 90 C, as in Charlie. For the Blue Alliance, that will be Alliance Three. The team from Shanghai. They're 79, 73 Alpha, and their alliance partner is 24 C, as in Charlie. The Supersonic Sparks. One minute, 13 seconds in the match. Red Alliance has several sacks that are scored in their high goal. Blue Alliance working to fill up one of their troughs. Now a defensive battle, far side of the field. 82-27, going up against 24-Z. Near side of the field, a lot of action located down there. 79-73, continuing to add sacks down to the Blue Alliance shot down on that end. Now 24-Z goes to reach in and grab some of the sacks from the Red Alliance out of their near side trunk, looking for a place to put them. 35 seconds remaining in the match. 82-27, Bravo now for the Red Alliance. Trying to rob the bank, picking up some of those sacks from the blue drop and putting them in their red drop. 25 seconds remaining now. Semi-final action here in the Mountain Division on field two. 15 seconds now, 15 seconds left. And it appears that 90-90 was up on the high goal for the Blue Alliance for a moment, but they've shaken themselves loose. Five seconds, five seconds remaining now. Oh, 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 oh. Red Alliance. 